you gotta keep the energy, man. Like, these people pay too much money, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't come on stage with my problems. They got enough problems. You know, it's thousands of people. So I gotta make sure, you know, I get myself together. If I gotta take two seconds, pray real quick, make sure I pray before every show, definitely. And, um, you know, just get my hair right and get in the game and we, we live, we going. It's no time to feel, you know, a certain way or nervous, like, it's go time. So, how I do it, um, I'll, I'll, I'll play the main parts, like, you know, the snares and kicks or whatever, like, and I'll make sure I lock in with hi-hat parts or whatever, and I just pretty much play around the part, like, I'll create feels around the part to try to not get stuck into playing, you know, just straight triggers. I try to find a feel here and there, find my spots, pick and choose. Okay, I know I'm gonna do a feel here, so, you know, and come back and lock back into the part. So, yeah, that's how I kind of go about that. He's a really good guy, man. Really great guy, man. Humble, very respectable guy, man. Like. That's my guy, man. That's my homie. That's my guy. That's my, you know, I work for him. That's, that's my man. Yeah. My days off, I'm going to be honest, these past days off, we had no days off. <laughs> Yesterday was my first day off, really. Um, we just came back from L.A. We had five shows in a row. Then we flew back to L.A. to go do the All-Star Weekend, do two shows out there. Flew back. Did, um, what was that, Wembley, we did Wembley Arena, and then the next day did the Brit Awards, and finally had another, no, after the Brit Awards, I had another show <laughs> the next day. The Brit Awards was my off day, so, yeah, we've been moving, but, you know, I, I wouldn't trade it for nothing, man. I'm very grateful, very appreciative, you know, and I enjoy it, man. This is my life. I've been meeting a lot of different guys here um, at the shows, man. It's been kind of crazy. I don't know them personally, but like people would hit me in, on Instagram or something. I'll respond back, you know, try to reach back out to them. And um, a couple guys there come after the show, like right above me. I'm like, yo, Rico, whatever. And I try to chat up with them, you know, for a little bit. I'm like, yo, hit me on Instagram. I'm going to follow you back. Let's keep in touch. Like, I'm always going to keep in touch with, you know, different people. Never know. I'm into meeting new people. I enjoy meeting new people. So, yeah. The 10 years from now, I don't, ain't no telling, man. I, I can't tell you at all, but can't tell you. But it's going to be crazy. Just know, i tell you like this. Every year... And this is God honest truth. Every year something big happens each year, like 16, 17, 18, like so on. Like something big happens. Like we just performed with um who's that? Um YouTube for the Grammys. Who does that? That's crazy. <laughs> like that's big. So it's like I feel like every year is something big. So 10 years from now, doing the Grammys twice. I'm excited. <laughs>